Hi, this is Steve Gilligan, and I just want to talk with you for a few minutes about the upcoming San Diego Trans Camp. Um, we do the Trans, trans Camp, we've been doing Trans Camp for a number of years in San Diego, which is where I live. This year, uh, the dates are ju June 22nd to July 10th, and um, I do a lot of trainings during the year. Uh, this is typically my favorite one. It's the sort of the granddaddy of them all. Um, we get a really beautiful multi multi-culture uh, community that is committed to doing really intensive, um, deep uh, personal and professional work. So um, I hope that you can join us. Um, if there is one word that we might use to describe what we focus on in trans camp that word would be creativity um, how to be able to create a great life um, how to create really good personal relationships um, how to create a really fun and rewarding um, and successful professional life where you can really make a great contribution to the world um, how to um, create a really good relationship with yourself, with your body, with your memory, with your sense of your future, um, with your own mind, if you will, so forth and so on. If you, when you look at different models and different descriptions of creativity, um, this underlying shared pattern that you'll find is that creativity is this conversation between two worlds. Um, on the one hand, you've got the creative unconscious, uh, this place of infinite possibilities, um, this place where everything is there, um, there are no limits. Um, and on the other hand, uh, we've got the conscious mind, which is connected to the rules, the regulations, the patterns, uh, the constraints of the external world and knows how to be able to uh, translate things from one world into the other. Um, so you need both in terms of leading a creative life. Unfortunately, in our contemporary world, there is this very strong bias um, into the conscious mind, a very strong bias in terms of living in the verbal, cognitive, externally oriented world. So what we, that's where trance really comes in um, very helpfully because it's a means by which you can be able to open this other creative space uh, where you can let go of your fixed perspectives, your rules, um, your regulations. Um, you can relax and you can be able to open into this really creative world where you can arrange, rearrange, uh, come up with new possibilities. So that's what trance is really for. Uh, traditionally, uh, the conscious mind in trance is, is held by an external presence, i.e. the hypnotist. Uh, what we do in generative trance and what uh, we've developed in generative trance is this way for the conscious mind, a person's own conscious mind, um, to be in this state of mindfulness and to be present uh, within the trance space in a particular way so that you truly do have the best of both worlds and you truly do have this creative conversation that's going on um, within each person. So that's what we focus on um, in Trance Camp is how you can develop that um, how you can develop it in yourself and how you can develop it in others, um, how you can use it to really make a um, positive, po profound difference um, in many different areas.